CBN partner Terry McCulloch grew up in a family that tithed and was raised to have faith in God's provision. He doesn't need our money, but he teaches us just really wonderful things through tithing. But when her husband of 28 years left her in 1998, that faith was tested. Terry had been a full-time mom while her husband worked and managed their finances. Without job experience or a college degree, Terry had a hard time starting a new life. It was a lot having our, our family kind of blown apart and now being on my own. I had never managed money. I always depended probably too heavily. Um, and so this was a whole new stretch for me. She moved into an apartment but was having no luck finding work. Terry started having anxiety and panic attacks. That's when she called the CBN Prayer Center. When I would hang up that phone, I could take a deep breath and know that God had this. He was going to see me through it and gave me great peace. Even though she struggled to keep up with bills, there was one thing that was non-negotiable. I was living month to month. The first month, I would sit down and write out my bills. The first check I would write was my tithe check. Finally, she landed an entry-level position in sales and marketing. She was excited about the job, but she had to stretch every dollar. Still, she gave and says God continued to provide. One night my dryer stopped working, so I went to my life group that night and one of the gals said, I had a wash and dryer in my house. One of the guys there had a truck, so they took care of it. Every need I had, God provided. Over time, Terry started getting pay increases and commissions, and her financial situation improved. She later met and married Bob. Terry says she never forgot how CBN helped her through her darkest time. I wanted other people to have that same support that I had. Today, she and Bob are faithful CBN partners. It's one way they can share the blessings God has given them. With both of our combined incomes and the way God has blessed us, now we're able to do for other people what they can't do for themselves. We're meant to be here to help each other in difficult times. We just say, God, show us somebody we can bless. And it turns out to be the biggest blessing for us.